Hi, in this video we are going to be learning about global variables and scope, right? And the scope, when we say scope in PHP, we have two scopes, local scope and global scope. When we say scope, we mean the environment, the context in which that specific element is available. So for example, if we have a global variable, that global variable is going to be available outside the functions and inside the functions. It's going to be a global variable. So if it's, a, if it's available outside and inside the function, we say that it's available in a global scope. If it's available only inside the function, we say that it's only available inside, it's only available in a local scope. So let's go ahead and find out how that works. Let's open our co-editors and let's do a save as on that blank, that PHP file that we always use. Let's call this scope. Scope php let's close this and let's open it in the browser all right so let's create a variable called ads here let's first put our php tags all right okay so first we create a variable called ads and then we are going to set the value for this one it's going to say outside then we're going to create a function and we're gonna call this function convert right All right and we are going to be using the same variable and trying to change it inside this function to a value called inside all right my thing is that I want to show you I want to echo this variable at outside right now and then I want to echo I want to actually call the function and try to change it with a function and then call it here again so that way to see if the, if the function changed the value of it okay so we see that this variable here we are echoing the first x that means this one here because it starts from the top right it's outside then we go inside the function we call the function right here and we try to change the variable to a different value, but it doesn't change it. So we, we still get the outside again when we echo it down here. Okay. Now, remember, this is the global scope right here outside. This is the local scope. Local. Okay. So now, how can we make this variable here global? How can we make it? available outside and inside the function so just in case I want to change the value of this variable later on inside a function how can I make it available because right now PHP is not even recognizing that this ver we try to change it here it's not even taking that change well the first thing that you need to do is actually write a key, use this keyword called global and then you put the variable here semicolon so you declare this variable global throughout the whole script. Now that we can use the variable and change the value of it anywhere we want. We can do whatever we want with this variable. Watch what happens on the left side when I save my document here. You see, it changed to inside now because now we're using the variable globally. This variable right here, we bring it inside the function, we change it, and then we echo. So first of all, we echo the first one right and then we go inside the, we call the function right here and we go inside and change the value of it and then echo it here so if I go ahead and echo this again we see that we get another inside because the values already changed but then I can go ahead and make another function here and change the value of it all right so this is what we mean when a variable is global and this is what we mean when we say that it's available in a global scope meaning outside and inside all right so anyways I hope this actually gave you a the information you were looking for hopefully you know you got this if you don't you can always ask me a question I'm always available for my students but this is what global variables and global and local scopes are all right and local uh, variables too so if this is in a local scope, of course, this is going to be a local variable. All right. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.